the United Nations Security Council, the UNSC, has listed Pakistan-based terrorist Abdul Rahman Maki as a global terrorist. Right, this is under the ISIL Daesh and Al-Qaeda Sanctions Committee. This listing comes after China last year put on India's bid to name the LET leader a global terrorist. In fact, in June 2022, India slammed China after it blocked the proposal to list terrorist Abdul Rahman Maki under the Sanctions Committee, also known as the UNSC 1216 uh, Committee. For the latest, let's go across to my colleague Maha, who's tracking the story. Maha, what details can you share with us currently? So there has been an attempt for uh, several years to get uh, Abdul Rahman Maki designated as a global terrorist by the 1267 Sanctions Committee of the United Nations Security Council. And the latest attempt was made in June last year uh, by a joint uh, uh, proposal by India and the United States that was uh, blocked by China. They had put a technical hold. A technical hold stands for about six months. So the six-month period has got over now. And uh, Abdul Rahman Maki has now been designated by the United Nations Security Council uh, as a global terrorist. Now, this basically means uh, that now his travel movements will be curbed. His bank accounts will be frozen. There will be no movement of arms. Uh, there will be an embargo on that as well. So it will clearly put uh, the, the 1267 Sanctions Committee basically ensures that uh, any sort of uh, terror funding to that particular individual is choked through this uh, uh, sanctioning. Uh, that is going to happen because, remember, the Justice Department of the United uh, uh, States uh, had uh, in uh, 2020 pointed out that even though uh, the Pakistani anti-terrorism court had convicted Maki on one count of terror financing and sentenced him to prison, uh, but uh, the problem persisted because uh, he was able to raise funds for the LET operations, the lashkar e -Tayaba. He belongs to the lashkar e -Tayaba, is a terrorist of the lashkar e -Tayaba. And finally now, uh, India's efforts at getting him sanctioned have uh, have borne fruit with the 1267 Sanctions Committee clearing it. Right. Uh, um, Maha, they're getting us uh, details and a background on uh, this uh, terrorist. Uh, well, uh, the action that has been taken against him uh, curbs on the movement of Abdul Rahman Maki.